Hello, everybody, and welcome to part 7 of Kamex Island. So, let's... I, I didn't say I was going to go to Totesimo, Totesimo's Fort or whatever it is first. Where are we going to Quicksand Chaos? To see what this level is all about. And I need a second power-up, if you don't mind. Not a mushroom, but points are good, too. Ah, you died. See, why do I keep spinning? I'm not even holding down the B button. Oh, second power. Good. I wonder if there's anything in that pipe. Nothing? Yeah, so we all know what the theme of this level is going to be. It's going to be quicksand, and lots of it! Whoa. Haha. <laughs> he was brutally murdered. Woo! Uh, there's a Yoshi coin up there. I could use that, but... At the same time, I really can't afford to get it. Oh, I, I actually jumped on him. Gotta look for any secrets that you can find. Because remember, there is a secret exit. You see, why was that one level so bad on power-ups? Oh, wait a minute, what's in here? Yeah, possibly just a Yoshi coin, but... You never know. Wait a minute. Ah, I gotcha. What, buddy? No! What was that? Game. Actually, you know what? I have a... Okay, seriously, cape. You know what? This cape of mine is really screwing us over. So you can stop your butt thumping. Oh my Jesus, Lord of Christ. Get out of the sand, you butt munching doofus. Okay, thank you. Go back here. We'll kill you off. We'll get our cape back on, because for some reason... Our character... Wait, this is for a vine? I thought this was for the key. This wasn't even for the key? Get out of here. Um, so this wasn't even for the key? Uh. So where exactly is the key? If that wasn't for the key, then where is it? Ah! All that work just to figure out there was nothing? Wait a minute, there's a vine right here. Where does this lead? Ah, Yoshi coin. Typical Yoshi coins. Yeah, we gotta... Are you serious? He was still able to get a fireball off. Oh my god, man. This is really quicksand chaos. There's no way around that. There's a vine up here, though. Uh, another Yoshi coin going this way. Okay, good. No! Yes, game. I know we've been at this level for far too long. But still. Ha, <laughs> we beat the level. So we gotta go back and find that key, and for some reason I have like six cords tangled up on my controller. How? I don't know, because I fixed it before the last recording, and the only thing I did was sleep, and it's not even near my bed. Bring us to a blank level. No oh, okay, the pyramids are Poltergeist Pyramid. Uh, we gotta go back to Quicksand Chaos and find that uh, key, which apparently is here somewhere. Uh, we're just probably not finding it. Yeah, I thought this level was gonna be somewhat easy. Okay, if we could just there we go. Make sure to check every block from now on. 
Apparently there's not a piranha plant in this pipe this time. So gotta check everything. Okay, we gotta wait for this doofus here. Because he thinks he owns this place. You know what? Get out of that piranha plant. Good. Good, good, good. Okay, so far no key. Okay, there we go, we got that. I knew that was gonna happen, now I can't kill this stupid thing. Oh, I can't duck there because of the, uh... You know what? Bet you it's under one of these guys' platforms. And that fireball traveled far. Ah! Oh, can you, like, just screw off for, like, ten seconds, sir? Thank you. I got this. We could go through here. Get the checkpoint. Get a power-up, and then go down that pipe. Thank you. Now, remember, we don't actually need to go up there for anything. That wasn't actually hard at all. I guess we just needed to hit that block. Silly me. Oh, that actually leads to a different uh, level. So I, I guess we should actually go do that fortress, because the fortress actually is kind of off to the side here. So we got Totomesu 2's Fort. That's actually a very tongue-twisting name. And every time I record, there's freaking jets out flying. Yeah, lovely. Ah! A red Switch Pals handy level. Oh god, the Sphinx is from Super Mario Land. Those things were actually a pain. Super Mario Land was a very difficult game compared to Super Mario Land 2. I think it's funny when people on their channels do Super Mario Land 2 before Super Mario Land. Uh, like the six golden coins. But I, it kind of makes sense because it's easier and doesn't really follow the same storyline at all. It's actually a lot longer too. So for some reason Game Boy games start off ridiculously short and I don't know why. But, whatever, uh, Khan is more is a great Let's Play, you should check him out. He also has a series called, uh, Let's Quick Play, where he plays, like, a game for, like, one episode, if it's, like, a really short game. It's, it's a pretty cool little series, and apparently there was a Potaboo there. Ah, oh, Jesus, I didn't even see that there. Okay, I really don't want to... Ah, I see him now. Oh, now we got... Rising and falling platforms in the lava. Very, very trickly. Oh, you do this in trickly. Oh, I. Oh, shit. I thought you couldn't go back there for some reason. I'm like. What? what why is the platform there when you can't get to it? Oh, God. Oh, they actually rise and fall. That's weird. Hmm. Is that the boss? Is that the boss already? How did you hit me, buddy? Ah, let's go in. Oh, it's the Sphinx boss from Super Mario Land. Okay. Oh, that that didn't work out very well. Everything takes like three hits in this game, though, which makes it really easy. Lots of points for something that wasn't too too difficult, actually. Not bad game. <laughs> that just leads us to quicksand chaos. That is pretty darn sad. Um, let's go do Chomp Romp first. Oh, I'm getting tired of these deserty backgrounds. At least the desert was not the second world. Like, oh hey Chain Chomp. I haven't seen you since Mario 3. This one just had a normal exit, so... Because you can't really look for... Oh god, Chain Chomps can kill the Koopas. So we can't really... We're not looking for too much here is what I'm trying to say. Now, apparently I went down this pipe without even trying. Can I go back up? Oh, shit. Got the Yoshi coin without even trying, but... Not what I was aiming to do because I lost my Fire Flower in the process. Away from me. Those things have such erratic attack patterns, man. What's that up there? There's a random coin up there. 
we got our fire flower, which is exactly what I need for this level. Death to you. Oh god, run. Ah! Oh, actually, they do leave after a while, which is kind of nice. Oh! They come right back. Run! Run, Chain Chomp! Don't you know that there's enemies on the loose? Like your father or mother? Oh god! It's Ben again. Yeah, there's no way I could have avoided that. Something because there was a man-eating piranha plant on one side and an evil chain drop on the other. Whoa. Whoa. Don't you dare pop back up, buddy. Ah! <laughs> We're out of there! The chain drop randomly flies away. Whew, that was terrifying. They're really pulling out all the stops, eh? That brings us to Triclide's castle. But, looks like we gotta go to Poltergeist Pyramid first. Oh, dry Bones in a, in a boo level. That's, that's actually, uh, kinda makes sense if you think of it. I have a feeling there's going to be a door right... What is this? Okay, let's, let's just see if this is like a... No, it's actually like a, a rock that we'll need to keep for something. Huh, I wonder what it's for. I actually have no clue, guys. I have never... Ever... Oh yeah, let's, let's try it like this. Shit. No, we did that wrong. We did that so wrong. I don't know if we can actually leave the level. Can you like... Ah, oh, fucking booze. Man, they're everywhere. Can I actually bring this rock through a door? No, I can't. Boo, bugger off. Can you like, screw off, Boo? Why is he like... Why are his patterns so erratic? Game, what are you doing resetting me completely? These boos have gotta go. Seriously, I can't jump now because that boo. See, like, why does he keep going after I turn around? Like, what is that? And why didn't I collect these coins before? And anyone know what this rock is for? I have no sweet clue why there's a rock here. Or why it's even in this freaking level. Is the piece switch up here? Yeah, the piece switch is up there. Oh, I get what it was for. It's for that. Okay. Dry bones, you're dead, meat, buddy. Whew. Okay. For some reason, I don't think we go in this door. I just don't think we go in that door. These boos here. Okay, boos. Yes, we're coming for you. I'm trying to see if there's anything up there. Thank you very much. What the f was that? Really, game? You just threw my P switch off the cliff. like screw off by chance wait a minute oh I know what I'm supposed to do I seen it did it did it seriously bring me back here where are we now ah fuck fuck we're back here this level is cruel and these boos really really Wait. Wait, what? This is my save point? Seriously? I know where I'm supposed to go now. Get out of here, Dry Bones. I thought I killed him, though. <laughs> and 
and apparently it can fall down the hole too. Okay, let's let's try this. And not let it fall down the hole. So apparently the pea switch can fall down the hole, but not Is this the way out of here? Are you fucking kidding me? Seriously, that dry bones just like randomly decided to waltz off the cliff. Come on, power up. Not P switch. You stay there. I don't need the P switch right now. What the? What the balls are you doing, Mr. Boo? Ah, let's go in this door. Wait, what's up here? Nothing. Ah, oh, I'm out of there. Thank you. We made it. Ooh. Sorry for the swears and stuff, guys. It is freezing in my room. I'm cranky because I'm sick and I'm sore. And yeah, that level was frustrating. Good news is, is it brought us to Tri Clyde's castle. Great, snakes that shoot fire now. Instead of sphinxes. Yeah, that, that that's that's even more lovely than normal. Good thing the green switch pals does help us out here if we don't freaking die to it. Okay, this time you know what? There's just coins in there. We've got one life. <sighs> Jesus. In the entire time we were here. Or in the entire last two recordings, and I am not losing my. F oh, his fires. What? How am I supposed to know that he was gonna shoot two like that? Oh, he shoots lots. I've heard this music before somewhere. I don't mean just in this hack, I mean, I've heard it somewhere before. Final Fantasy, maybe? Some game I played, yeah, I think it's like Final Fantasy 7 or something. Or maybe Final Fantasy for the DS. Maybe. Maybe it's like a horror game or something for like the SNES. It just sounds like something you hear. See, it's funny, you don't see a lot of feathers until late in the game. Okay, so we're gonna deal with more of these snakes, which I am not a fan of in the slightest. The castle itself, though, is a, is kind of a break from the last couple levels. And they attack off-screen, too, which makes them even worse. Ah, yeah. Hey, giant fuzzies. Or not fuzzies, sparkies, jeez. Yeah, fuzzies are those floating things that make Yoshi get high. Ah, oh, did you guys see, uh... Um, Rufi Bonga's latest episode of Psycho Blue. Yeah, where he finally beats the Catcoon Cat Kingdom. Yeah, it was pretty good, and I just lost my freaking feather again to a doofus. Not gonna bother rewinding it there, though. This is a castle, and it should be somewhat difficult, just I don't like this. I hate those snakes so much, their attack patterns are all over the place. Oddly angled, and oh god, ones that we can't kill anymore. Ah, yeah. Okay, yeah, so, uh, Solo Warlock channel dead. This channel is because it's filled with fun games that I would never have played otherwise. Okay, Feather? I don't know if a Feather's gonna help me with a boss, but let's try. Who is it? Oh god, how do we. Shit, are you serious? Ah! Oh, wait a minute, what am I doing? Okay, you know what? Let's try this again. Ah, yeah. uh, are you serious, game? What is it doing? There we go. Oh god, we barely did it. 
<laughs> we did it a small Mario. Woo! Not that bad. Not bad at all. So let's go see what the next world is. World 5. Ah, mountainous level. So we have... It looks like the Mountain Cliff World next. So in the next episode, we will be going to Bullet Bluffs. Peace out, guys.